Hey guys, Callie here. Today's video is going to be something I promised a really long time ago but never had the chance to do it. So today I am going to do a Shopee haul, home edition. So I'm sure you've been victimized by Shopee. I mean, who hasn't? It's so bad but at the same time, it's also such a stress reliever. Because of quarantine, it seems like everyone now is an interior designer. Everyone's fixing up their space since we're just at home. We want our surroundings to be nice and relaxing and that's why now everyone's redecorating. I'm one of those people and I never thought I would find it so fun to shop for kitchen stuff and house stuff because normally, yeah, I buy clothes, makeup, shoes, but I never really spent on like curtains, pillows, utensils and all that. I never saw the point in it. Like my mom loves it, obviously. And it's one of those things that lockdown has taught me. It's such a tita thing, but I really do love it. I'm here to share with you everything I found. This is the home edition. This is just the first of my many Shopee hauls. I couldn't fit everything in one video. So this will be in, I think, three parts. So this will be the home edition. And then next, I'm gonna do the fashion edition. And then my third will probably be my bedroom edition. So here goes nothing. If this is something that interests you, keep on watching. The first item is this candle holder. You can see you just put the candle inside. So I have this fake candle here. I'm gonna turn it on. And then I'll just put it like this. So I put this beside my bed. It's super cute. It's around 500 pesos. So next item are these. These are my fake flowers. I know everyone's into dried flowers because it lasts longer. But it just don't like the smell. Like I have a couple of dried flowers here. But there's an off smell. And I think it's from the drying process. It kind of smells like sewage. I don't like the smell so I try not to put so many dried flowers in the condo but these look real don't they? Next is the succulent vase. I love it because it's marble and gold. If you don't notice my background is actually just gray and gold and white so that's a theme that I have and this one fit in perfectly. This was so much cheaper on Shopee than the online sites. Like I saw this going for maybe like 800 to 1000 pesos on those reseller sites. But this one was just like 350. Such a steal. And there are different sizes. This is the biggest size. And then next are these. These are my yoga figurines. They're so cute. So I do yoga. And I love it because they're different yoga poses. There were so many to choose from. I think there were like maybe 10 designs. So I just chose three. So look, it's so relaxing to look at. And this one was also super affordable. Each cost like less than 200 pesos. I'm super addicted to coffee. So I got this coffee print. Well, it's half a coffee print and half a wine print, which is perfect. So AM is coffee and PM is wine. It's so cute. I have a coffee corner where I put all my coffee beans and then my coffee machine and then my grinder and all that. So this is where it goes. I'm going to do a tour about that soon, so watch out for that. Next is this wine glass. So I actually posted this on Instagram a couple of days ago and everyone kept asking me for the link. So here it is. I am going to link it down below, of course. So it's so cute because it's a body base. And it's also super duper cheap. Like, I think it's around 150. But I saw another reseller selling it for like 600 pesos. So it was no offense. Like, it was kind of a rip off because that was too high in my opinion. And surprisingly, the quality is actually really good. It's not flimsy, it's real glass. It is light though, but I think it's so perfect and it's so cute. Like this is perfect if you're entertaining your girlfriends. And it also makes a really cute gift. The next item is another kitchen piece. These are my marble containers. So I put in my creamer and my coffee beans in here. 
As you can see, it comes with a small spoon. So you don't have to get another spoon and you can just put it inside. It's so cute. It fits in my theme of marble and white and gray. So this one was a little pricey, but it was worth it. The quality is super good. And then to match that, of course, I also got another marble print and these are coasters. So I really hate it when people leave glasses on tables and then you see the water puddle. It's my pet peeve, like I clean it right away. Of course, I had to get coasters to protect the table and also so that it doesn't make a mess. This one comes already six pieces. Next are actually the things behind me, these throw pillows. Well, not this one. And this one I've had for a long time. But this and this. These two I got on Chavi. It's so cute. It comes in this frill thingy. What do you call that? It has those frills. <laughs> it's so cute. So it's kind of like bohemian. And then this one is just simple. It's just a checkered print. But it's like velvet. It's super soft. So these are also, so this came in two pieces for 350 pesos and then this one I had to buy it individually, it was around 200 pesos. Okay, my next item is this coffee grinder. So as I said a while ago, I have a coffee corner and I've really been trying to learn all about coffee. I've been watching all these YouTube videos on how to make lattes and like Starbucks drinks and everyone there has a coffee grinder so I bought one too. Isn't it so cute? And it matches my coffee machine which is also black and gray. Next, I'm going to show you my tray of spices. So here, it's so cute because you can turn it like that. So you can see all the spices. And then you can just choose. As you can see, I have chili pepper, which is my favorite. I love anything spicy. And then there's oregano, paprika, and then there's also this Japanese spice. Yeah. So this is super candy in the kitchen. And then this is also another item that's super useful in the kitchen. This one, it's for your cooking utensils. So when you're cooking, you, instead of putting it on the table, you put it here so that it's cleaner. To be honest, I don't really cook. So it's actually for my boyfriend. <laughs> He's the one who cooks for me. So I bought him this. And then I'm going to show you my fruit basket, which is not really a fruit basket right now because I put chips in it. Yeah, so here. Now it's my chips holder, but it's super cute. It also comes in this gold color to fit my theme. And it's super handy, it's so big. So many things can fit in it. Originally, I was supposed to put like bananas, oranges in it, but I haven't gone to the grocery, so you can see my popcorn. <laughs> and then next are my pet stuff. So I actually bought so many pet things because I just got a new cat. So I bought all her toys there, her litter, and her vitamins, but it hasn't arrived. So I'm just gonna show you two items. First is this. This is a pet bowl, but what makes this unique is that your cat doesn't have a hard time drinking because it moves. So it's pretty cool. Like, apparently, if your cat's drinking like that, it can strain their neck. So this one helps. Of course, it's in white to fit my theme. All my pet items also have to fit the theme. Or else, I won't buy it. <laughs> and then another pet item that's super useful. I kept looking for this because I really hate it that when I feed my cats, like my hand gets dirty when I scoop inside their food so I had to buy this so I transfer the food here and then it comes with a cup so I just pour it and then put it in their bowl it's super useful and it makes it the process less messy 
Okay, oops, I forgot about this. Another home item is this candle holder. Of course, it's in gold. It fits my theme, so it's perfect for the living room. So this is my vintage mirror. It looks vintage, but it's not vintage. It's brand new, and it's actually just plastic. So the quality is just okay. It's not so great, but it looks aesthetically pleasing. Like from afar, it looks so cute. So it makes a good decor piece, and at the same time, it's functional. So I put this on my vanity. Last but not least is this gold tray. This is where I put all my perfumes. So this also goes on my vanity desk. It's so classy to look at and the quality is really good. My issue was last time I bought this gold tray from another online site. I won't say where it was from. And it was delivered to me completely shattered. And after that, I got so scared to order again anything fragile. But I took a risk and ordered this because it was just so cute and it was so much cheaper on Shopee than and all those other sides. This was just 500 pesos. So it was super worth it. If I bought in those retail sites, it would cost me times three the amount. It was worth the risk and I'm happy it was packaged really well. It was bubble wrapped. And surprisingly, I have had no bad experience with Shopee. Everything I've ordered was of good quality. I haven't made a mistake yet. And I really do take the time to read the reviews and also ask around because some of my friends also shop on it. So I ask them what's nice and then they give me recommendations. I still have so many things to show you but that will be in part two. So stay tuned for that. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next.